Well, we definitely want to move quickly, you know, and I think we've got a lot of interest in this position. Obviously, I don't think you can beat our facilities and in, in, in being in a conference that is probably the SEC of Division II football, I guess you could say. So a lot of interest from a lot of people, uh, sitting head coaches, um, assistant coaches, and we're gonna look at every angle to find the best per person we can for Missouri Western. I want some energy. I want a person that can come in here and, and build uh, up our relationships with our high school coaches and really go after uh, recruit and really sell this place. And um, you know, I think Finding somebody that knows our league, you know, I don't think you can ever walk in this league and, and be successful right away unless you know this league and know what kind of talent goes into this league because it is definitely the best in the, in the country. Knowledge of Missouri Western, that's important too, but in the end it's finding the right person whether they're a sitting head coach or an assistant coach uh, to, to come in and lead this program. I've never put a number on wins, um, I never have, uh, but the expectations are high. But I think the expectations for a total program are what we want to put in place. And that's, that's uh, academics, that's athletics, that's working in the community and being part of, of our other 16 sports and being the leader of our other 16 sports is, is probably the most important thing. I think this sells itself, but I also think we need somebody that has the energy to really capitalize on this and, and compete. And, and continue to continue to build on what we have, uh, which could be difficult. Any any time you do that, it is it is difficult. You know, I think we need to look. You know, in the next three weeks, we're going to have a football coach in here. I hope. You know, and I think uh, with all this interest, though, I think we need to do our due diligence, do our homework, and make sure we're not just doing a quick hire just to get somebody in here. And I think part of the positive is we're not going to need a lot of recruits, a lot of signees. For, to fill our holes that we have, and I think that's probably a, a good thing. It's not like we need 25, 30 kids in this recruiting class, and I think that's probably a positive for us, and, but we're gonna do our due diligence and find the right person.